Hi, good day everyone and welcome to my video lesson. I am Teacher Rose Morales from Catalino G. Tampipi Elementary School, Matanawan District. And I am going to discuss with you English 6, Quarter 1, Lesson 3 of the most essential learning competency, the milk, with the objective identifying real or make-believe facts or non-facts images and of course with a key to 12 curriculum guide code with the grade level standards which is the learner listens critically communicates feelings and ideas orally and in writing with a high level of proficiency and reads various text types materials to serve learning needs in meeting a wide range of life's purposes. Now, I am going to show pictures and you are going to name the person in each picture, okay? First picture, who is this? Do you know him? Yes, he is Senator Manny Pacquiao. He is one of our Senator and at the same time, he is the world famous boxer. Next picture, who is this? Yes, she is Snow White. She is the famous cartoon character. Next picture. Do you know him? Yes, he is President Rodrigo Roa Duterte, our very own president. Next. Who is this? Do you know him? Yes, Olaf. Have you seen Olaf? Have you seen the movie um, Frozen? Olaf is the friend of Elsa in the in the movie Frozen. And the last picture we have who is this? Yes, Spider-Man. And Spider-Man is also one of the famous cartoon character. Based on the picture shown, identify if they are real or fantasy. By the way, can you still remember what is real or fantasy? Very good. Now, number one, Senator Manny Pacquiao. Is he real or fantasy? Very good. He is real. How about Snow White? Is she real or fantasy? Very good. Fantasy. Why do you say Snow White is fantasy? Yes. Snow White is fantasy because she is just a magical cartoon character. She is not true and she doesn't exist. How about number three? President Rodrigo Duterte. Is he real or fantasy? Yes, very good. He is real. In fact, he is our president. How about Olaf? Very good. Olaf is fantasy because he is just a magical cartoon character. How about our last picture? Spider-Man. Is he real or fantasy? Very good. Fantasy because he is just a cartoon character. Character. He doesn't exist in real life. This time, we are going to read the story. But before reading the story, we are going to unlock some difficult words for better understanding of the story. I am going to show scrambled letters and then you are going to arrange the scrambled letters to form a word according to its meaning. First, what do you think is this word? It is a sequence of actions regularly followed. What is it? Very good, a routine. Routine is a sequence of actions regularly followed. Let's try to read the sentence. Most of the doctors have a routine of visiting patients at the hospital after hours. Ne Next, we have, what do you think is this word? It caused someone to feel consternation and distress. What do you think is this word? Yes, it is dismay. 
This may can cause someone to feel consternation and distress. Let's read the sentence. They were dismayed by the U-turn policy. Next, we have, what is this word? It actually existing as a thing or occurring in fact, not imagined or supposed. This is real. Correct. Real is actually existing as a thing or occurring in fact, not imagined or supposed. Now, we are going to read the story. But before reading the story, kindly look at the picture. What can you say about this picture? Yes, there is a girl sitting beside the pan. <clears throat> I am now going to read the story. But you can also read the story with me. You can get and open your module. Quarter 1, Lesson 3, page 18. Are you now ready to read the story with me? Bea lives in the small barangay of Santa Rita in the town of Oton. Every day, she wakes up early to go to the farm and feed their family's carabao. That day, after her morning routine, she decided to drop by her favorite stop by the pond. She sat down for a couple of minutes and talk to her reflection in the water. Her nanai had once told about the diwata appearing in the water of the pan. Anybody who talks to her reflection by the water will see the diwata and can make a wish. So, Bea tried her luck. When Bea was about to open her mouth, a beautiful face appeared. Surely, not her own reflection. Because she wanted to prove that this was real, she rubbed her eyes again and again. To her dismay, when she looked at the water, the face suddenly disappeared. Bea was disappointed for missing her chance to talk to the Diwata. She went home as fast as she could and told her nanai about what happened. Understand the story? Very good. Now let's have comprehension questions. Number one, what does Bia do every day? Yes, every day, Bia wakes up early to go to the farm and feed their family's carabao. Very good. Next, what does Bia wanted to see in the pan? Correct. Bea wanted to see a diwata. Next. Did Bea see the diwata? Hmm, yes? No? Let's see. After what happened, what did Bea feel? Exactly right. Bea was dismayed because she missed her chance to talk to the Diwata. So Bea was not able to see a Diwata. That's why she was disappointed. So Bea was not able to see the Diwata. Going back to the story, there, there are underlined phrases or sentences. Kindly identify what are those underlined phrases? What is the first one? Yes, she wakes up early to go to the farm and feed their family's carabao. Next, and talk to her reflection in the water. Next, the water appearing in the water of the pond. See the diwata and can make a wish. She rubbed her eyes again and again, and the face suddenly disappeared. So those are the underlined phrases or sentences in the story. Now I have arranged 
those underlined phrases in two columns. Try, try to look at this. What have you observed in the first column? How about in the second column? Yes, the first column are real. It actually happened in real life. While in the second column, they are make-believe. They are not true. They could not happen in real life. So they are make-believe. Now, what do you think are real and make-believe? Now, everybody read. Kindly read with me. Real images are true. They are facts and can be proven. They can be experienced or witnessed by a person. When identifying statements that express reality, one should look into things, ideas, and events based on real-life experience using the five senses. Seeing, smelling, tasting, hearing, and feeling. Examples Babies cry when they are hungry. Is it real? Is it reality? Yes. There are seven days in a week. Is it true? Yes. How about the last one? My grandmother is still alive at the age of 93, which is true. How about make-believe? Make-believe images have no existence. They are not true. They are in our imagination. They are non fact and difficult to be proven. Make-believe images are created in our minds. They are exaggerated most of the time. That is why they are unbelievable to happen. Example, you have the tree talk to the boy. Is it true? Have you seen a boy talking to a tree or have you seen a tree talking to a boy? No. Next, the fisherman caught a mountain of fish last night but still was penniless. Is it true? No. How about the other one? It was raining cats and dogs. The water flooded the city and it almost reached the clouds, which is unbelievable. So these examples are make-believe. They are not true. Can you now differentiate real from make-believe? Let's try to read this. Real it is a fact are true they are something that has occurred or has been proven while make-believe is non-fact not true or probable opinion or falsehood just remember that it is real if it is correct and believable while in make-believe just remember that it is only an opinion and it is unbelievable. Did you understand now? Okay. Next. Now you are ready to apply what you have learned about reality and fantasy. Do this fun activity. Think wisely. Use your experience, knowledge, and do critical thinking to correctly choose the group of words as suggested by the instruction that will complete the following sentences. Are you ready? Number 1. To make my bones strong, this is reality. A. I will drink milk once a year. B. I will drink milk every day. C. I will drink milk every minute every day. What do you think is the correct answer? Yes. 
To make my bones strong, I will drink milk every day. That's reality. Next. To get a perfect score in the test, this is fantasy. What will you do? A. I will use my superpowers to read my teacher's mind. B. I will study overnight. C. I will sleep early. So what's the answer? You're right. I will use my superpowers to read my teacher's mind, which is fantasy. Number three. To buy my dream bicycle, fantasy. A. I will save money in my piggy bank. B. I will ask Santa Claus to give it as a Christmas present. C. I will get along with my mom and dad. What do you think is the answer? You're right. I will ask Santa Claus to give it a Christmas present, which is fantasy. Which is not true. Number four. To go to Hong Kong Disneyland reality, A. I will ride in an airplane. B. I will ride on a magic carpet. C. I will soar like an eagle on air. What's the answer? Yes. I will ride in an airplane which is reality. And the last one. In order to grow some plants in my garden reality, A. I will talk kiss and hug them every day. B. I will look after and water them every day. And C. I will let the animals play in the garden. What is the correct answer? Yes, very good. I will look after and water them every day. Now, let's have another activity for you to understand more about our lessons. This activity Using your knowledge and experience, you are going to identify the following images if they are real or make-believe. Provide your answer by putting a check mark for real and an X mark for make-believe. Ready? Okay, number one. Is this real or make-believe? Yes, it is a check. It is reality. How about number two? This is real or make-believe? Very good. That is make-believe. So, X. Number three. What is that picture? That is very good. That's make-believe. That's an X. They are the mutant ninja turtle. They are not true. How about number four? There is a teacher and the children. What is that? Okay, that is real, real or reality. So that is check. And the last picture, what do you think is this? Yes, it is real or reality. Now, did you get the correct answer? I'm sure you know already how to differentiate or identify real or make-believe. Now, you're going to answer the assessment activity. You're going to identify whether they are real or make-believe. Write your answer on the space provided. Are you ready? Okay, number one. It is a picture of a man sitting on the moon what do you think is this very good it is make believe number two what is this very good it is real number three a man with lots a woman with lots of money it is real very good what number four what is that very good. Make believe. A girl talking to a tree. Make believe. Next, and the last one. A nipa hat. What is that? Very good. It is real. Did you get the perfect score? Who got perfect? Very good. And 
to strengthen your knowledge and skills let's have additional activities read the sentences do you think they can happen or exist in real life write the word real if they can and make believe if they cannot okay number one the Karyun family lives in a remote city in the town of Igboras. What is the correct answer? Very good. This is real. Next. Capres lived in the mountains of Igboras. And what's the answer? Very good. That's make-believe. Number three. The Capres appeared at night to frighten the village people. And what's the answer? Yes, make believe. Number four, the fathers in the built houses were made of nipahat. What's the answer? Very good, that's real. Number five, many villagers were eaten by the capre. What's the answer? Yes, it is make believe. Number six, Nell and Cell were classmates since preschool. What is the correct answer? You're right. That is real. And number seven, Cell's mom is a well-known self-proclaimed witch in their place. What's the answer? Great. That is make-believe. Number eight, Nell and Cell loved to play at Cell's house every afternoon. What's the answer? Yes, that is real. And number nine, Cell's mom heals sick people with their magic potion. What is the answer? That is correct. That is make believe. And the last one, she can turn herself to a bird at night and visit one house to the other what is the correct answer very good that is make believe did you get the correct answer did you get the perfect score very good great job everyone this is the end of our lesson thank you